Hello everyone! Welcome back to our channel. We hope you're having a great day. Today, we're going to talk about a man who came back from the dead. Yeah, you heard that right. So, take a deep breath. But before we jump into our video, don't forget to click the bell button and subscribe to our channel for more fun and exciting videos. Today, we're going to share with you the tragedy that went down with a soccer player by the name of Hiana Kamba. Kamba had been a successful player for a German soccer team. He was respected for being one of the best assets of the team. He was the real MVP of most of the matches, a good player with a good reputation. That was sure to induce a sense of jealousy among the other teammates, who were not happy with their fellow team member getting all the praise. Kamba had moved from the Congo to Germany along with his family to fulfill his dream. Although his family was deported by the officials from Germany back to the Congo, he was allowed to stay due to him being a great asset for the country's soccer future. Now he was officially a German citizen. After some time, the team had to make a visit to the Congo for a match. Kamba had the chance to shine bright, but he didn't know what unfortunate things were coming his way. The team played the match and they returned to Germany, but they realized that there was no trace of Kamba among the members. Initially, thinking that he would have stayed in his native country for a time, he was reported to be dead shortly after. The cause of death was described to be a car accident. Everyone was in shock, but people moved on shortly after. Fast forward to four years later, Kamba is alive and reappears on the scene. In order to prove his identity, the unfortunate soul had to give interviews to newspapers. He described the tragedy that went down with him. Turns out it was an ultimate case of betrayal. The sneaky and jealous team members had joined forces in order to get him out of their way. They planned to take him to a visit of Interior Congo during their stay, and sneakily took away his money, telephone, and all the legal documents and left him stranded on a strange place. Although he was native to the country, he hadn't been there ever since his childhood. Besides this, he had lost contact with his family ever since they were deported from Germany. Now, he was just a stranger in his old native country. For quite some time, he tried to find a place in the country. After a while, he was in a good position to contact the German embassy. He reached the office to prove his identity, but there was a lack of documentation. Therefore, the process was stopped then and there. And on top of that, they informed him that a man of his name had been pronounced dead. How is this possible? There's another side to the story that includes his fraudulent wife. She wanted to take full advantage of the reports of her husband being dead. She definitely had the mind of a cunning fox as she went to officials to confirm his death and provided them with a fake death certificate. The main reason was that she wanted to secure all of his life insurance. Kamba had to take four years to settle matters and be able to go back to Germany. The first thing he did was go to a prosecutor to prove his citizenship to Germany. Fortunately, the prosecutor did hear the poor man and this time his case was reopened. His identity was finally proven and they came to know that it was his wife who faked his death. She was missing at that point, but her arrest warrants were immediately granted for the crime of insurance fraud. Kamba has now gotten back his citizenship. He stays and works in Germany for a German energy company. All this way, he has definitely learned the lesson to beware of bad people. That's the end of today's video. We certainly hope you like it. And if you did, leave us a comment down below letting us know what you thought. Don't forget to leave us a thumbs up and click that bell button so you don't miss any of our updates. And as always, thanks for watching. 